Today we're taking a look at the new 2024 Axis 31 by Athens Archery. Welcome back to Mike's Archery and today we are taking a look at the new 2024 lineup from Athens Archery and we have got the new Axis 31. Now this is a brand new bow from Athens with a completely redesigned system on the cams and the tuning. Uh, it's basically a rebuild from their last year's bow. Now let's take a look at some of the specs on the 31. The speed rating on this bow is going to come in at 335 feet per second. Now the axle axle on this bow is 31 inches, giving it an overall cam to cam length of 35 and 3 8 Now the brace height on this bow is 7 inches, which is a nice high brace height and it's going to give a forgiving shootable bow. The overall weight on this bow is advertised at 4.4 pounds. We took it out of the box, threw it on the scale as we always do, and got a real weight of 4.8 pounds. Pulled the dampeners out of the limbs, got it down to 4.6. So coming in a little heavier than what the advertised weight is. Now the draw length option on this cam is going to go from 25 all the way out to 31 inches with a half inch increment on that. So you got plenty of adjustment to fit pretty much every archer, even on this shorter axle to axle bow. Now the draw weight options on these bows are going to come to you with the option of 40, 50, 60, as well as the 65, 70, and 80. So Athens has tried to cover pretty much everybody on the weight scale to fit your needs. Now the let off on this cam is going to be adjustable from 70 to 90% making it one of the more adjustable cams like a lot of the market has gone to. Now let's look at some of the features that they have changed on this new bow. With the new RTX rotating cam, you've got a rotating mod on there with the adjustable let off. It's gonna allow you to adjust that, as we said, in half inch increments. Has a nice large flat stop on it. Should make it a little more solid in the back wall. But overall, it's got a lot of adjustment built into this new cam. Now the big change for this year is the AccuTune cam system. This is what we noticed first of all when it came out of the box. It is their new tuning system on the top and bottom. It is a threaded axle and it's not one you can really work on too much because it's got a system built in there that allows you to adjust that cam left and right to get that perfect paper tear and get this bow shooting perfectly for your needs. Now it's very similar to what we have seen on the market from some other people, but having no shims in there is gonna give it a lot of tunability and make it really easy to adjust on the line for you at home or us here at the shop. From there, they've got the new Limlock 2.0 pockets, locking this system into the riser, giving it an extremely stable platform. So Athens has integrated all their accessories for this year, starting with their integrated rest mount. You've got the dovetail on the back that allows you to use any of the integrated models not only just QAD, but a lot of the other manufacturers are following suit with that integration option. They also added a pick rail up front. That's going to allow you to put any type site on there that has a pick rail option. And they're every day coming with new options from a lot of different manufacturers. So you've got tons of choices out there for new sites for these integrated systems. They also added the TCS roller guard as well as the limb dampeners and the same grip from last year, which we really like on these Athens. It's got a great feel and shootability to it. Now, as we look at the colors for the new Athens, as usual, Athens has a huge color palette. This year is no different. We've got a ton of solid options with a textured black, a green beret, the flat dark earth, your slate, willow, pearl white, your majesty purple, mallard, as well as a green wing teal and a hummingbird. Frankly, you're going to have to jump on the website to get a real feel for what some of those colors look like, but some of them are pretty awesome and make some great looking target bows. Now on the camo side, they've done a color fusion camo with their conifer gray. They've kept that autumn blaze as well as a true timber strata and the scree solace. So some great camo patterns that are going to set it apart and look a little different from some of the other bows on the market. Now, as far as the price point on the new Athens, they're coming to you at $1,199. So for a flagship model, it is falling right in there with what we're seeing from most everybody on the market for this year at $1,200. From here, let's step back to the lane, shoot this bow over the chronograph and give you a complete breakdown, not only from 350 out to 500 grains, but also the noise rating on this bow and just an overall feel for it. So we step back here to the lane and we've got the new Athens Axis 31. We're going to shoot this over the chronograph and get you some speeds and specs on this bow. As usual, we are going to be shooting this bow at 70 pounds at 29 inch draw length with 90% let off. So let's see what kind of numbers this bow puts up. All right, so with a 350 grain arrow, we are getting speeds at 302 out of this bow. Now, as you go up in weight with a 400 grain arrow, we've got 285. 
And with a 450 grain error, we got 272. And with a 500 grain error, we've got 256. So putting out some pretty nice speeds um, overall, about where we expected it to be. Uh, just a nice feeling bow. So as far as the noise rating on this bow, uh, we've got it coming in at 94.6 decibels. Fairly quiet as well. A nice bow uh, for hunting. Uh, it's going to be right there in the wheelhouse of what we're seeing out of a lot of these new bows. Now, as far as the overall feel for this bow, um, draw cycle is really nice. We like the new cam design and how it rolls over on this new Axios. Uh, it comes over nice, feels nice. On the back wall, uh, it just depends on what you like. We thought it would be more solid. It's got just a little bit of sponginess on the back wall of it. Uh, but if you like that feel, then you're fine. I'm sure depending on where you put it and what draw length, uh, we'll make some adjustments there. Uh, but we felt it had just a little bit of a spongy back wall, more so than what we've seen out of some stuff in the past. But as far as that goes, the grip, everything else, the aftershot, Athens has got a really nice bow. We're pleased with the improvements that they made for this year and the changes. Uh, this tunability here in this system is going to be really nice for us here at the shop, working with your customer. Uh, and if you're at home and you've got a little issue, you're trying to paper tune or whatever, uh, it's going to be really nice to be able to adjust top and bottom on those cams and just move that back and forth. No press needed, uh, no shims falling out on the floor. So that's really the new, new winning system here from Athens for that. So we're excited to see where they go from here. But if you're looking for a new Athens, stop in at Mike's Archery. Give us a call here at the shop. Stop on the website and we'll get one of these new Athens Axis 31s in your hand.